Hello, I'm Sasha Bakarik. I'm gonna show you just a little tiny bit of the technique that I'm using. Um, this is a bone dry piece, um, a vase that I made, and I'm gonna use terra sigillata on it, which is like a, a very refined slip where I add um, black ceramic stain. Um, this, the terra sigillata is actually a very ancient technique that all um, ancient civilizations used to basically seal the pots. Um, it's not non-porous in the way that we consider it to be non-porous. It still seeps through, but it was probably good enough to hold water or food in pottery that basically did not have, the, the glazes were not yet invented. Um, the technique was basically forgotten until 19th century when a German engineer um, rediscovered it for sewer pipes. Um, so what I'm doing is now is kind of buffing it to get this little sheen in it, basically just aligning the particles of clay um, and that's that. So I'm going to do that on the other side um, just because I want the seams to be done at the same time. Otherwise, there is a risk of peeling. Um, I'm just using a brush. I used to use, I used to spray it on, but um, it's kind of a hazardous thing to do because particles would get airborne and the black ceramic stain has all sorts of nasty chemicals in it. So I decided that I'm going to have to live with brush strokes showing so that I save my health, I guess. So she's going to do the same thing on this side. Just buff it up a little. And then um, I'll start showing on the other side what I do. Basically, all my work is inspired by microscopic images, so I am kind of thinking that this is some sort of like some sort of colony of bacteria or cells or something like that. So I just free free draw. This technique it's called it's graffito where I'm basically just getting into the lower level of white clay. Um, and this is where I'm spending the most of my time. I will not show you this whole thing because it's going to take hours, but I guess you get the idea. And that's that. Thank you.